coverage you can count on continues with Glenn Marini Sports 15 Report. Death and taxes are both sure things, but you could add something else to life's certainties today. Whether it was New Haven, whether it was Norwell, an NHC team was definitely going to win a baseball regional championship. Norwell, New Haven, squaring off in Decatur. Don't adjust your TV set. This kid's hair is blue. Weird. Pick it up at the top of the seventh. 5-2 New Haven, but hold on. Josh Van Meter with a sack fly. In comes Landon Curry. Now it's 5-3. A little bit later, Kyler Mills. You saw the last one didn't get over the outfielder's head. This one does. It's a double. In comes Noah Patton. It's now 5-4. Two outs, though. Norwell threatening. Brandon Pease gets the K, and that ends the game as New Haven wins this one 5-4 for their second straight regional championship. Good isn't good, isn't good enough. That's our main quote for the year, and last year we were good, but that's not good enough this year, so that's what we're looking for. We've traveled. We've played out of a bus. We've played out of a motel, um, so we've kind of got ourselves turning ready, and, uh, you know, we've got a veteran group of kids who really show a lot of poise. So you add all those things together, it kind of makes for a nice recipe for us. Bulldogs advance to face Mishawaka Marion Saturday at Semi-State. For a regional championship game as Carroll rolls over Richmond, we're talking 14-4 to in just six innings. The Chargers, of course, the defending state champs, they'll take on Crown Point at Semi-State. In 2A, down at Wabash, Northfield falls to Taylor 1-0. To the Norse finishing the year with a 25-6 record. And in 1A, it's Blackhawk in South Central. And the Braves lose a close one by the final of 6-5. Blackhawk ending the year with a 14-11 record.